York University is really an ideal venue host for the games. The new stadium is going to be a game changer. It will really add tremendous facility to our already existing infrastructure. The games are a major sporting event involving thousands of athletes. For York to be a part of a competition of an international nature like that, I think is just a, a wonderful opportunity. The stadium will see 12,500 during the games, 5,000 in the legacy condition. We're so proud to welcome people to our campus and to this fabulous facility. We have teams with records of both provincial and national success. And then we have an amazing array of athletes who've enjoyed success, both as varsity athletes, but also on provincial, national, international, and Olympic stages. This facility will be hosting the track and field events. It's a 400 meter track made of synthetic surface and it's designed for the highest level of international competition. Some of the best athletes in the world are coming to our backyard to have their time of their lives. It's just outstanding. So that we know that, hey, we're playing in the best of the best. So with the games approaching, a popular question is always whether elite athletes are born or made. And some of the things that we're looking at in our studies, ranging from everything from the personal characteristics that a person brings to the athlete endeavor to the kind of parents they have, the coaches they interacted with, up to big things like genetic factors and how hard they're willing to work. And so it's, it's a really complex web of variables that predicts uh, an individual's level of attainment in the sports setting. So we most certainly look forward to be the host venue for the games and to what comes after that where we will have the infrastructure that will enable us to advance our commitment to athletics and recreation and will support also the local community and the future Canadian athletes.